All right, guys, quick video update. Kind of exciting. I think it's exciting. I get excited about water. When I find a water that's really, really awesome, uh, I want to spread that around. So I got this at Walmart. I think it's 88 cents for a gallon. But check out what the process of how this is made. If you guys watched my videos, or you saw the other video I did up on uh, reverse osmosis. Now, reverse osmosis is an expensive process to do. Ultraviolet light is another expensive process to do. You combine those two, you've got the best water on the earth, as far as I'm concerned. The only problem with this one is that's in a plastic container. But I found this at Walmart. Check this out. Come on, focus. You see that process? Reverse osmosis ultraviolet light. Are you kidding me? Are you serious? That is so awesome, I can't even begin to explain. Now, what I would do, I'd advise to you guys, is to take this water and put it in a glass jar. Get some big glass jars, you know, that you keep whatever in, you know, rice or something in. Um, <clears throat> add Himalayan sea salt. You gotta add a pinch of Himalayan sea salt. I got this at, um, I think, Whole Foods or something for eight bucks, but that eight bucks has lasted me probably five or six months. So let me just show you quickly what a, I don't think I'm going to be able to do this with one hand here. <clears throat> Basically, I get a pinch of this and then stick it in there. So I'm making a mess. No, there's a, you know, there's somewhat of, you know, I got to do another video of uh, showing you guys my uh, parts per million meter. I'll stick the meter in here without the salt and it'll register zero in digital meter and then I'll put the salt in shake it up and it'll go up like four or five hundred parts per million which is awesome all right so I'm about to have some bentonite clay because of the heavy chemtrail spraying right now all right so this is a fine powder uh, it's clay it's dry and I'll add this to this glass here I'll fill it up halfway with water three quarters of the way with water let it sit for an hour shake it and then drink it. You just can't drink it uh, right away because um, it's a little bit harsh on your uh, kidneys otherwise. All right, folks, God bless you. Go pick up 10 gallons of this water today. Every week, 10 gallons. Use it for your tea, your coffee. Um, <clears throat> heck, use it to shower with if you can afford it. And uh, drink it. Drink a gallon a day. Got to put the sea salt in it, but all right, God bless you.